Kaiju is a Japanese word for a uh, big monster, and I think that's just uh, the mentality when I step on the court. I see Kai in five years sending me front row tickets so I can go watch him play for whatever NBA team. There you go. A little quicker, a little quicker, get him firing. We are at Prasco right now in Cincinnati, and we're gonna work out with my guys. And that's it. There you go. My name is Ben Creamer. I'm the performance director at Ignition APG, and today we're working with Kai Soto, working on really developing him as an athlete with his mobility, stability, and strength to help him perform better on the court, but obviously be more resilient and have longevity in the sport. There we go. He's very attentive, he's, he's focused, he's in tune with his body, and he, he wants to get better. He's starting to get that intrinsic motivation that you can't really replicate with a, with a coach. I guess that's what he envied me. There we go. I see Kai in five years sending me front row tickets so I can go fly me and my wife out to go watch him play for whatever NBA team. I think it's working, I think you're getting stronger. Yeah. Good. Dante Harlan, I'm the operations manager. I like to make him come in here and, and work out after hitting the weights hard. I'm not gonna let him take a playoff. Get into me, let's go, what's up? Good, jab, get there. Good, ball screen, shot. Let's go, let's go. I do this every day, doing weight lifting first is hard because you'll be a little sore after. But one way or another, you still have to push through it in order to get better and just have to give it your all. You will see the, the effects and the improvements after, so it's a good feeling. Kai is really skilled already coming in. It's just really about getting him ready for the next level, best we can. He's been working hard. I push him, I challenge him, and he's responded well. This is an everyday grind if this is a goal or a dream you want. And we talk about this. Do you want to just do it, or do you really want to do it? Good, elevate. There it is. That's pretty. Hi, my name is Lori Allen, and we're here at Hi-Fi Yoga. Yoga is super important for basketball players, or really any athlete. We're getting them to get that stretch, learn a little bit more about their bodies. So learning those body mechanics, knowing the body, knowing how the body works, and knowing how to breathe with the body is just the perfect fit for any athlete. We had the class heated, we were about 100 degrees, and we had a good time. There we go. <laughs> Can I hire you? It was an honor and a privilege to practice with each and every one of you. Namaste. Awesome job. Thank you, guys. You guys are great. Can I, can I get a picture with you guys? Yes. Yeah. Arms under the water, pump those arms. Pick those knees up, pick those knees up. This is how we get them 20 rebounds right here, Kai. This is overtime. Let's go. Come on, work hard, guys, work hard. I know it's painful, work hard. Come on, Kai. Switch those hips. Got 100 calf raises. Take that ball shoulder to shoulder. Good job, good job, way to work, way to work. Be the last man standing. Are you gonna come up with it, Kai, or you gonna give it up? Slide, 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 slide. How has your workouts progressed from the first one you first started? It's been good. I really feel lighter, stronger. Okay. 
I feel more confident on my my shot. Yeah. To be honest, you've been getting your 500 up every day. Right? Yeah. yeah. You're definitely getting better. I see yeah. it on a regular. You still been staying flexible, stretching and stuff. Yeah. So she did hot yoga earlier. Yeah. It's just normal yoga is is good. The hot yoga. But just being like hot. You don't like that heat. It's like you're doing yoga in a sauna. Yep. No, that you know what that helps you with? Breathing, yeah. Breathing. And see, that's one thing. You build up your cardiovascular system, you be able to play longer, you yeah. know what I'm saying, harder, like, you got to run another big. Yeah. I don't care what these other guys, the size, range, just that and the other, your length and your ability. This is why I've been talking to you about see yourself as 7'3". See yourself as that guy. Because ultimately, even though you're coming from the Philippines, you have way more potential to reach your ceiling than a lot of other players out there. You got a lot of proof. It's, it's really a mindset. Like, Kai, if it's in between your ears, there's no stopping you, all right? Don't let anything distract you until you can walk across that stage, take the commissioner's hand, you on the ground. You know the vibes fam, listen, the drops don't stop and neither do the blessings. If you want to get drippy like your boy, you know you do, all you got to do is click the link over here. Also, don't forget to subscribe this away and check out more fire videos over here. You know what it is, it's the away or no way.